आमंत्रित करूंगी बहुमुखी प्रतिभा के धनी श्री सुनील टंडन जी को जो कि आई यानी इंडियन इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ मास कम्युनिकेशन के डायरेक्टर जनरल हैं आप लोकसभा टीवी में सीईओ भी रह चुके हैं और आपकी गणना देश के जाने माने न्यूज रीडर्स और थिएटर डायरेक्टर्स में की जाती है जर्नलिज्म इज अ प्रोफेशन व्हिच हैज लॉट ऑफ प्रेशर्स ऑफ टाइम यू हैव टू वेरी क्विकली डिसाइड ऑन व्हाट इज हैपनिंग एंड राइट अबाउट इट एंड देयरफॉर अ जर्नलिस्ट इज ऑलवेज टू बी वेल प्रिपेयर्ड द अवेयरनेस लेवल ऑफ जनरल नॉलेज अवेयरनेस ऑफ द वर्ल्ड ऑफ द कंट्री ऑफ various subjects has to be quite diverse and quite in perspective a journalist cannot be an expert on every subject but a journalist must have a glancing knowledge of most subjects that he or she writes about or talks about so awareness is absolutely primary you must have a passion to communicate but there are perils also in that passion as we see again and again nowadays and we see them particularly in the more tabloid form of journalism or we see it in the some of the news channels that we have in our country that there is a tendency to sensationalize and draw attention to yourself by being as shrill as possible obviously this is a tendency that has to be avoided because a journalist must always present a balanced view without that balanced view of differing perspectives the journalist loses his or her primary power and that is the power of credibility unless you are credible you cannot function as the fourth pillar of democracy i want to give you some examples of some journalists also who go into specialized areas of interest i think you have to really examine within yourself what are your various areas is it political reporting is it crime is it rural is it uh, development is it science there are all kinds of fields now and in each field you need to have some kind of knowledge legal reporting is another area where you need to have knowledge before you can really venture forward and we have an example of somebody like uh, p sainath for instance of the hindu who has created such a uh, uh, precedent of reporting on the kind of stories that nobody else was writing about and yet alerting the nation through rigorous examination of facts through rigorous research journalism is often seen when one is very young when one goes into the profession as a place where you have glamour where you have recognition but please remember no recognition comes no true recognition or respect comes unless you are credible and sincere to your task and unless you embody that passion may the budding journalists flower into great names that we will hear about and will respect in the future thank you